What's up, Whitney? I'm Ananya. And I'm Alexis. We're your prom heads and we'll be your hosts today. Ace Week campaigns have been crazy this week. Yeah. Do you know who's running? Of course. Keeping up with candidates is my favorite thing. Let's throw it over and listen to our ASP executive candidate speeches. What's up, Whitney? I'm Cameron Warren and I'm going to be your next Director of Internal Affairs. What's up, Whitney? My name is Andrew Duak and I'm going to be your next Director of Finances. And shout out to ARSU, VG, JP, and JH. Hey everyone, my name is Gabby, and I'm so excited to serve as next year's ASB Vice President. Konnichiwa, my name is Tristan K. Huang, and I want to be Secretary of ASB. In the Whitney Sea, where academics is our treasure, maybe the real treasure at Whitney is the friends we made along the way. As many of us want to spend the precious time with our friends filled with fun and hype, my experience as well as the ASB crew will bring the spirit. What experience you may ask? Well, currently I am the class junior vice president and many of you may have seen me around as Jungkook, The Weeknd, or even Suguru Geto for school activities. Next year, I will gear up and bring the school spirit to another level. Vote Tristan Huang for your ASB secretary. Yeah. What's up guys, my name is William Kang and I'm running to be your next ASB secretary. Today, you may have seen basketball cards lying around the school, but today we're doing one last card opening. Let's see what we get. No way, did we get a legendary Bo William Kang for ASB secretary card? And what's this on the back? Career stats and reasons to vote? Let me read it to all you guys. If elected, this would be my fourth year in ASB. I've served as class treasurer, vice president, and I'm currently the sophomore president. I've committed to ASB almost ever since seventh grade and have helped build up the school. But on a more serious note, throughout this time, I've listened to the opinions and the ideas of my class and have funders with my cabinet to help make all these experiences possible. The countless hours I spent serving our school shows my commitment to you guys and hard work ethics. I'm a suitable candidate and when ready to serve the school on a whole basis now. I can do all this while also having fun, as you have seen throughout my campaign. So remember, go join the Kang, bang, Kang gang, let's make next year a bang. Thank you. Dun dun. Dun dun. Meow, meow, meow. Dun dun. Dun dun. Meow, 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 meow. Ka-ching. That's right. It's lightning. What's up, guys? I know you see the hair. And no, it's not the Little Mermaid. It's Alex. ka -ching! Running to be your next ASB president. This year, I served in the ASB executive cabinet as your director of finances in my fourth year of ASB. 
I planned so many fun activities this year, but oh my god, I'm so hungry for some glizzies. That's right. This year, I planned all of our fun competitions in the quad, including our glizzy goblin competition, where my glizzy goblin king, Samarth Sethi, got first place. I pinky promise all of you that if I win this year, I will continue to be a great leader at our school. Ka-ching! Peace out! What's up, guys? I'm Stanley Cannon, and I'm running to you. Whoa! What's up guys, it's Flat Stanley, and I'm running to be your next ASD president. Now, you may be wondering, why would you vote for a guy who only has two dimensions? Well, I'm more 3D than you think. Uh, today at lunch, I went around and I asked all the students at Whitney what they wanted to see at Whitney, and they wrote their messages on Flat Stanley. As your next ASD president, I want to be very vocal about what all the students at Whitney want. So I want to make sure that everything that you guys write on this gets made into a reality. Everything that you guys want gets made into a reality. Now you may be wondering, why else did you vote for me? I've had four years of ASB experience ever since the eighth grade, and I've been consistent at it and uh, very dedicated to ASB. This last year has been my favorite year at ASB. I have introduced, as I have introduced all the new seventh graders into their first time at AS, into their first time at Whitney through new student orientation. I want to make sure that everyone at uh, everyone at Whitney has the same great experiences as they do. Make sure to vote Flat Stanley for ASB president. Speeches and good luck. Class election speeches are tomorrow during homeroom. Seniors stay in your homeroom classes. Juniors are in the MAC. Sophomores are near junior pit. Freshmen are at the sophomore tables. Eighth theaters are by Miss Hulette's room. And seventh theaters are near Mr. Wallace's room. Voting starts tomorrow at 5 p.m. and ends on Sunday at midnight. Everyone will get an email with a link through their MyABCUSD account, so make sure you vote for your favorite candidate before Sunday midnight. The election celebration will be held next Monday during lunch in the gym. You know, we have another really big event coming up soon. The election celebration, right? Didn't I just talk about it? No, I mean prom. Oh, you're right. Wait, where even is prom this year? Um, prom fashion show was kind of a while ago, I forgot. But we can watch the prom venue reveal video for a refresher. Take it away. Prom 2024 Meet Me in Atlantis will be held at the Reef in Long Beach from 7 to 11 p.m. on Saturday, April 20th. Tickets are $75 and regular sale ends on April 8th. So get your tickets soon since they won't be sold after that. Wow, $75 is pretty affordable compared to past years. Yeah, this year Prom Club was able to raise enough money to bring prom to you at such a low price. This was only possible with our sponsors this year, Whitney PTSA, Whitney Foundation, and Whitney Korean Parents Association. Thank you so much to all the organizations and individuals who support our efforts this year. All of your help will ensure a memorable night for all of our juniors and seniors. Hey, speaking of memories, let's throw it over to Karuna for a video about what our own faculty remembers from their high school proms. What's your name? <laughs> this, hold on, hold on, what are you doing? What's your name? Mr. Up. Have you been to prom before? I have. Tell me about your favorite experience. My favorite experience is just hanging out with my friends and uh, yeah, enjoying the night together, dancing. Did you ask someone out? I did. How? I just asked her, do you want to go to prom? Did you like her? <laughs> As a friend, yes. You sure? Hundred percent. Did you get her like flowers or something? Do you like have to? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You get, you get like the corsage and like the boutonniere, all that stuff. Rent the limousine. It's it's a fun night. What's your social security number? It's a uh, one two <laughs> five. No, are you seriously gonna put all this? Up? Cut it out. You're totally not gonna cut this out. What's her name? That wasn't Carmen. Me. Carmen. Very interesting. I'll find her. 
No, I won't. Can you guys get out of my room now? I'm here with Miss Hunter. So tell us about your prom experience. Um, there is some slight trauma associated with that for me. So I'm going to let Mrs. Perry, who was a witness and a part of the asking in a sense, she can tell my story. I give her full permission. So it was my first year teaching and I was a pep squad advisor. So I had over 30 girls that had been talking about the prom. One girl in particular had not been yes, yet asked to the prom. And so we convinced her that she should ask the guy she wanted to go with. This brave, brave girl, Denise, went up to this guy who did not know how lucky he was and asked him to the prom. And he said, I don't know, let me think about it. I cannot tell you how angry we all were. And the fact that he's alive right now is amazing. So if you're out there, anybody ask who you want to go to the prom, to go to the prom. And if you want to go with them, say yes immediately or say no. I'm here with Miss Bloomfield. Um, so you've been to prom. What would you say your favorite memory from prom is? Some of my favorite memories of prom were going together as a big group. I also remember that we went out to dinner before we got to the prom location, rented a limo all together, and I think that was the first time I had ever been in a limousine. And then I remember the DJ was really good and we had a good time on the dance floor. I'm here with Ms. Olsen. What is your favorite moment from prom? Probably going to dinner with my friends. What would you say about people asking other people? Don't put them on the spot. Don't make it awkward. What is your favorite moment from prom? It was just that I got to go with my high school sweetheart who is my wife. Both That's times. So Hello. Prom when I was in school was hard dancing competition with couples. Just having a good time. Make sure everybody have a wonderful time together. And then after that, we kind of slow down a little bit where I could talk to my girl and sing to my girl, and that's why she married me. Yes. Before we move on, quick correction the election celebration will be held in the MAC and not the gym. Back to our program. That video was so cute. Shout out to Miss Hunter for asking out that guy. She's a real one for that. Penanya, have you asked anyone out to prom? No, I haven't. You totally should. And if you submit your asking video, you and your day could win a free admission into prom. No way. Let's look at this video with more info on our promposal competition. Proposal videos by April 6th, either to our Instagram at promclub25 underscore or send an email to promclub25 at gmail.com. Winners will be announced on April 10th on Whitney Live. Let's wrap, up, let's wrap up this live with a few announcements. Prom Club is hosting a basketball fundraiser game next Wednesday, March 27th during lunch against girls and boys varsity. Tickets are on sale right now for $3 at the finance office. Tickets will not be sold at the door, so make sure to get them soon. The last day to purchase tickets is next Tuesday. Also, Whitney Live's Easter egg hunt is happening right now. Don't forget to keep track of the eggs you find and follow our Instagram at WhitneyHS.Live for more info. Also, Bottom Locker's performances are tonight and tomorrow at 6 p.m. Come out and support our young star's hard work. Finally, the last day to buy prom tickets is Monday, April 8th, so make sure to buy our tickets soon. See, See you at prom! prom.